Hello guys, welcome to CG family again. Today we are gonna learn about how to make this head covering gear. Some people call it hijab also. This also can be used as a winter headwear. So we are gonna make this today. And also we are gonna use tech on avatar tool that I have taught you before. So this is the one with the help of tech on avatar we are gonna make this headwear. So let's start guys. This is a 3D and 2D view. We are gonna need both. This is the clothes we made earlier. If you wanna know how did I make this, please let me know in the comment section. So let's start with the headwear. Let's take a rectangle first and make a square with it. Because we want equilateral triangle. That's why we are taking a square first. And now we are gonna use the internal polygon tool. So we are gonna join these two points. And we are gonna select this and cut. Now it's in two parts. So let's select one part and delete this because we just need an equilateral triangle for this. So let's rotate this. In 3D view also, we want this to be covering the head, so just lay it flat. It's a bit small, so we are gonna make it bigger and here is this. So let's shift this again. Yes, I think this will be right. Okay. Now to cover the hat because our skull is spherical, so we need to make sure it doesn't crease on the hat. We're gonna do this. Select the line. Go to split, split this in half, and then we are going to again split this with a few inches, like five. I think five will be enough. Okay, and same on the other side, split. I think four is enough. Yeah. So we are going to delete this one. Do this again. Four inches is enough. Now, just just shift it a bit up so that I can see the skull. Okay. Now, just select the point and right click on it and go to Add Dot. We are gonna make this with a little triangle so add the dot and width I'm gonna put it on increase a bit I think this is good now increase the length I think 5 is enough okay now we are gonna do this with the other two points put the width same and just a bit lower in width, 4.5 is enough. Same with the other one, 1.5, and what should be 4.5, same as the other one. Now, as I have got this, I'm gonna first see. I already had the fabric, so that's why it's coming out like this. Reset. Reset. Okay. Well, so now you can see this is the default fabric we got. So now just do the simulation. Okay. 
Well, as you can see, it's good. I think it's still a bit small, so I need this to be a bit bigger. Let's reset 3D. Now just do the simulation again. Now you can see, I think it's good. I'm just gonna shift this a bit back. Just drag the cloth. That will do the trick. I'm just gonna increase this so select this so like this so like this and go to edit that I'm gonna increase the width to two Um I'm let this again. We should increase the length also. So edit that again. Increase the length to 7 and 5 and this to increase the length to 6 and this to Put the line to six. Now simulate it. Adjust this a bit. So since now it's covered, we are going to wrap this around. First we have to tag this on Avatar so that it won't budge. For that, take the tag on Avatar tool. Just click on your Avatar and then click on your fabric. Same like this. Do this on the other side, click on after and click on your fabric and then simulate. What's been done? Let's see how it's turned out. Okay, now with this done, we are going to wrap this around. For that, you have to go on the pin and press W for this to select and select down line like this. Now we are going to drag this. So as you can see, the fabric is moving with this. Drag this up. We want to wrap this around. so. Let's do this. Just drag it.
Now for the other end also, you can see the simulation. The holes are coming out good. For that also, we have to click on the pin, press W, select mesh. And then again, we are going to drag this. This is our head care we wanted to. Let's just put a material on it so that we can see it properly. Let's make it black. And let's just put a 2D texture on it. A 2D texture is really helpful on the fabric, guys. As you can see, I put it on my Dress 2, I'm gonna increase it and show you. As you can see, this this is our dress. I'm gonna put a color. As you can see, same like this, we're gonna put it here for that. You only have to go to your graphic 2D pattern tool. Just click on it. It will take to your library. Select a material you wanna. And then just left click on it. It will give you how long you want it. What size you want it. So we're just gonna increase the size. Because I want it on the whole border. Both sides. And now I'm going to rotate it. This is our pattern as you can see. So that's all for this time today guys. If you want to learn something else, please let me know. And if you like this video, please like, share and subscribe to our channel CG Family. Thank you so much guys. See you next time.